Generic greetings and welcome back once again to TCG Card Shop Simulator. Today's beverage is a quite potent Raspberry Blast Soda. So welcome back to the game. Let's open the shop here. And previously we were increasing our stock by going for things like these boosters and some dice. Obviously we've got these uh, singles here as well that we're selling. So let's just continue on with uh, all of this in mind. We're trying to make a bit of profit where we can. Um, let's go with maybe 8 for whatever that card is and over to uh, that one which is, I think I'm going to put that as maybe 650 50, why not? And then done. And oh, it looks like we've got some customers already who are wanting to buy that was some blue dice there. Uh, change of uh, five, six, seven, and off they go. We can see already we've got a good amount of customers uh, in today, which is pretty good. 4150 for uh, their purchases there. And oh, it looks like we've got someone who's a bit stinky. Um, oh, it looks like. So this is a single of the sold. Yes, we'll have to sort that out as well. And then another one as well. Is uh, <laughs> is that the ones that I've recently put on? It might have been. Let's just go to uh, sort album in terms of price, and we'll put uh, the most expensive one on there. Uh, Six fifty for that one. We could probably go with. I think I said it was worth uh, about five. So yeah, we'll put up a little, a little bit. And then that one's also fine. And oh, looks like we're gonna have to um, <laughs> do a bit of spring. And sorry about that. And that'll go back on the shelf there. So I do want to probably get some more um, boosters. If we check out the phone here and stock order, we can get really big boxes for 200. We could go for, uh, oh, shop level eight is required for this next one. We're almost there though. And shop level 12, some of the others, looks like that's not gonna happen. Uh, accessories wise, we haven't got any card. No, we do, sorry, we do have some card sleeves, but we are, oh, I'm sorry, there's the customers here. Let me go ahead and uh, <laughs> serve the customers. 23 for this thing. Thing, which is pretty good good sales already and let's put maybe that one in there and let's set the price of uh, maybe uh, should we risk it five uh, it's worth 361 yeah we'll, we'll try it um i don't know if we need another table in just yet or not oh looks like we've uh, sold another single here and it's a booster as well ah we're trying to hide the uh <laughs> trying to hide the uh, card underneath no we saw that anyway uh, let's go ahead and do some restocking so we've got some uh, black dice there we've got some white dice which we're not yet selling and then we've got blue dice which we can pop on the shelf and I don't know why but this is apparently where we're now storing uh, all of this stuff I think that's all pretty much done and that can go there so I think we need to get some I mean do we want to order more boosters and uh, well for a start let's go to stock orders and accessories I do want another couple of the card uh, sleeves I don't I think maybe we'll also go for maybe a deck box but we'll see about that later on we've also got some figurines as well but maybe not just yet I'm gonna add another one of those in and maybe another one of those in and then we'll purchase that and oh customers and there we go uh, changes to and off the go so we'll open up these here and get them on the shelf obviously we did uh, tear open a lot of these oh, looks like we're gonna need uh, a lot more of those uh, in the future let me just go ahead and uh, get these all put on yeah we did tear open a lot of these in the previous episodes specifically so we'll probably do something similar again it's really good for leveling up the shop which is uh, pretty handy i'm just gonna put that in there and we've got more of these card sleeves which we'll put in there and then obviously in the other ones as well and that should be it i think uh, yes and then we've got another one to uh, perhaps fill that up Mm, and there we go. So we'll store that in the corner like that. And oh, it looks like this is a bit of mega purchase here. And change to is 23. So 20, 1, 2, 3, 50. And there we go. How much did we make on that one? A fairly decent amount, actually. Uh, and then another couple of singles has been sold. So we'll go with uh, this thing for 350. Yeah, that you know. Uh, we're, we're running out of um, cards to sell if the <laughs> if the uh, 
Yeah, if the the highest we're making is uh, about three fifty, yeah, uh, <laughs> it's not great, is it? Anyway, another customer here uh, who's just bought a single there, and they've given us the right change. Okay, so boosters wise, um, oh look at that, we need to probably order some more of those packets. We'll order how many do we need? Um, we'll just probably just order a box of four, and we'll probably order another pack of those, and I think we'll also order some spray. And that should do it. So another 200 spent there, but obviously spending it in the right place. Let's just put those on the shelf. And standard procedure here. There's the spray which we do sell a lot of, and indeed use a lot of on the customers. <laughs> which is, um, yeah, well, it's a questionable action in the retail business. It's uh, somewhat frowned upon. Anyway, I'm going to probably, oh, I'll serve this customer, I think we're going to open some boosters, because why not? Um, uh, 10, 15, 16 it is. So let's go ahead and take some items, so we'll do that I think, and then we're going to open the packs, and obviously just blast through this one. A uh, couple of new cards, total value is uh, 13. Oh, we've got a, a pixie there, first edition's uh, shiny. By the look of it, very good. So hopefully we'll get a couple more of those. Looks like that was not a great open, but yeah, do what we can. And we're now shop level 8, I've just realised as well, because as I said, you do get a lot of experience uh, doing this. Oh, there's an Amni Shark, and that's worth uh, 67. Pretty good indeed. And I think this is going to be the last one to open, and that was not great. Oh no, one more by the look of it. And again, nothing of great value. In fact, it's literally 233. Okay, so we made no money off that one. Um, 650 for this particular one, and there we go. And some spray, and that's uh, 1, 2, 50 for the change. And that person has an interesting... <laughs> Look, <laughs> looking down, uh, 50, all right. So I guess we can go with this one and we'll sell that for 70, I think. Uh, yes, it does put zeros on the end, which is fine. Uh, that one, which is gonna be, it says 12, let's go with 14. And, oh, was that the customer coming over to buy that one? I think they might have been. <laughs> Yeah, all right. In terms of the DIY, do I need um, any more shelving? I mean, I'm probably going to pick up... Um, can't get really any of those for now. Uh, oh, there's a customer here. Let me just uh, go ahead and swerve them. 15, and there it is. I don't think we need another... I don't think we need another set of tables and chairs. For shop expansion, we could get... We could get a shop expansion, but I don't think we necessarily need it. Um, what I'd like ideally is card packs. Can we go for, oh yeah, you can get the big card packs, but we can't get the other uh, licenses. I'd like maybe to start selling some of these deck boxes, perhaps, but that'll require some more shelving like that. In fact, that's probably what I'll do. That's probably what I'll do. Well, you've also got, um, game systems as well so maybe we go with game systems well i need at minimum metal racking so i'm going to get i'm actually going to purchase two of them because that's this that's what we've done with these ones and i just think it's uh, the way we're doing this it just uh, matches up i guess although mm, this might be a mistake because the don't know if uh, it'll actually fit um oh 77 for that one which is pretty good there's some more deck boxes in a single card which is only 11. I thought it was going to be a lot more than that one. All right, so if I was to get, say, the game systems, um, accessories, no, not there. It's uh, oh, a tabletop. So it's speed robo games. We could go for game system one, in brackets, two license, and maybe sell some of that, or do I stick with the plan and go with accessories and go with card sleeves? Hmm, I'm going to... I don't see any point in picking up the the first license, actually. Let's put the lights on. Oh, that's one thing as well. Um, pay bills. We are okay on that one, actually. What about also recruiting? Level 10 for a slow checkout person. Oh, looks like we've got a stinky customer. And there we go. Put that back. Maybe another... Do I need another table, actually? I don't know if they were going to come and sit down. Oh, this uh, is completely... 
I was going to say completely empty. That's obviously not the case. There's only half, but it's been completely um, bought out since I last really looked at it, which is all good. Let's go ahead and put these on the on here and that one. I mean, there could be a lot more. We could look into this one. I know there's like some similar items about the place, but I haven't really bothered. It looks like the... Uh, what colours? Oh, there's a problem now. So I need to know what that is. Oh, that red. I was going to say, is it red? Because that's the one I need to put on there. Uh, let's serve this customer. There's three sets of dice. And oh, this is going to be a bit of a purchase, isn't it? Um, 855, 67, 850. And there it goes. And that was 91 generic units of currency. And do we do another, another, per do we do another draw? Maybe, but there's customers coming here, so we'll do that. 36. Don't know if the price for that is okay. We'll have a look. Uh, it changes for... What's the price? Uh, price seems to be fine. Let's go ahead and do a open. Total value of <laughs> £2 odd. Yes, not even the generic units of currency that, that we've paid for the <laughs> actual cards. In fact, so far, nothing has even paid for the cards. Oh, that one only just has. Nothing rare. Nothing we're going to make any money on here, really. There's a claw something in the middle. It's shiny, but nothing like amazing. Hmm. Okay. That was... That was a bit disappointing, truth be told. Okay. Well, we'll do what we can. Just going to double check the pricing of these ones. Seventeen thirty-seven. I'm going to change the price of the dice to eighteen fifty, and then this one. I'm going to change that to sixteen. That one is fine. 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 And about right as well. Okay. All right. Probably need to have a look at accessories. Do I copy the colours across? I think I do. What I mean by that is, for we have red dice at the top. Then we've got red deck boxes. I'm going to pick up that license and add that. Well, the customers coming? Oh, no, there's a customer there as well. Potential customers. So, yeah, I think we'll have, again, red. I was going to say red and then blue, but I don't know if there's blue deck boxes. Accessories. Red, blue, yellow, and green. So there isn't black or white. So I will do red and blue, and then the black and white, instead of being black or white here, we'll do uh, the, the green... And yellow. And 24 for that one. There it is. And, ah, oh, press enter to start the next day. Well, I won't do that because obviously people are still playing and when they stand up and leave, we gain money for that. What I will do is order in the next bit of stock, which is the boosters. Uh, sorry, deck boxes. Deck boxes. Hmm. Do I just have a big row of deck boxes? I don't see why not. So, 1746, we're going to sell them for 19. And it's just this, you know, just these two customers. If I press enter, will it, will it kick them out? Well, it will. And, oh yeah, they make the money anyway. That's fine. It's probably going to say we've lost money because of, obviously, we've got new stuff. That's okay. And let's see. Open the shop. Get the shop open. I need something on that, uh, the bottom of that shelf as well. So what's the next big thing, really? I'm not sure. Let's um, sort this by price. What's the most expensive card we have? 742, which is this Amni Shark. 
It's like VR. It's like just proper in your face, that one. And oh, sorry. Uh, customers, deck boxes straight away, we're selling. I'm gonna give us 20. There you go. Uh, 37, 50. You know, it's uh, already selling, which is pretty good. I think I need to restock these boosters, which will be, I mean, the license is okay for the next one's 500 for the license. Consider the lights on all night. <laughs> I don't know if I get another one of these as well. I'm not sure. Uh, what what box is this? Red. Can't put it there. What box is this? White. Card sleeves. They don't appear to be selling. Which one's this? Black. So I have one left. Let me double check the price for that. Price is actually still okay, I think. Oh, there we go. Once again, we got some uh, nice deck box sales. I'm gonna order in the new cards. Well, not the new cards. I guess technically the new to us, but what I mean is they are just a restock, really. And we do make good money off those. I actually haven't checked the finance. I don't know if there's any way to check finances and how much we've... Uh, is that empty or not? I think it was empty, yes. I don't know if there's any way to check what's our main moneymaker. Is there a way? There's your price lists and such, but... Yeah, I'm not sure. Not sure. So, we'll obviously go for the other deck boxes. That'll be of some use. I think what we'll do is we're also going to do a bit of a draw. And here we go. Again, not great. Card value was a total of nine. That's two sets of nine. That's ten at eighty. So nothing like major here. We haven't really drawn anything like in the hundreds, anything super super rare. We're still drawing new cards though, which is curious, but I think there's over a thousand cards in the game. <laughs> Uh, that's a crab locks on the right. Open 100 packs of cards. The achievement, wow. So that was um, fairly poor, once again. Five, six, seven, eight. But it's uh, it's what can happen. That is 30 and 50. And there's that one as well. What are you stuck on the boosters? Which is this? Black dice? No. What's this? Blue dice? No. Basically we just need red. Which is that one? Yes. Okay. Look at that, the boosters are going down. Uh, the, yeah, the, the card boxes are going down. Let's go with price. We're already selling. Already selling those, but hey. This is a Tentacool. It's not. It's a Jill Celine, I think. 750 for that one. Confirm that. Another deck box. Looks like there was a 20 note. And this is 28. Okay, I don't know if I'm selling these deck boxes at a high enough price. I'm not gonna alter the price. It's it's working okay. So accessories. I do want blue license and I'll add that to the basket Then I'll pick up the other licenses as well I'd like to get at least those filled with those that we I know we got space down the bottom there we can always well, we can put whatever we, we need on them ones do I open some more boosters hoping for some rares I do okay here we go Nine pound. Generic of currency. Nothing. Oh, this is not going to be worth much at all. Four. And, oh. Four zero six. Nothing. This one's going to be another nine. Yeah. That is. Oh, <laughs> not even two fifty. <laughs> yeah, we're basically getting loads of repeats here. And this is where 
the accusations of bias get flung around. <laughs> oh, that was pathetic. That was 150 for that one. We've lost so much money off doing that. Well, uh, potentially, actually. Potentially lost so much money because obviously we haven't sold them. Let's go ahead and put one of those in. Don't recognize it, so here's new. And that one. Go for 650 on that one. Such a weird card. A um, couple, of, couple of sets of dice here. Which was good to see. Put them back on the shelf. Which one's this? Blue. Oh, just sitting all on their own. <laughs> oh, another cell. And 15 change. There we go. So I'm tempted to... I don't think there's a price for that because I don't recognise the card, no. I'm tempted to uh, do a restock over there. Just one sprays it, no problem. No change required. And, hmm, 227 for, and 50 for the blue deck box. Total price, 232.36. Yeah, just open the album. Just gonna sort that by price. How's that done? And, oh, this should be a good sale. Uh, 26.50, 25.650. All right, and there it is. So, Get that purchased, and it's going to be blue. This is the deck box brand, that famous, well-known brand. <laughs> and 22 for that one. The price for this is 17.75. That's the market price. We got it for 19, and then the blue is market price is 20 and 67. So we'll knock it up. Got some dice and some boosters here. 40. And 50. So the other colours, not a bad price really. Didn't see you picking them up though. <laughs> Do we have to. No. Don't think we have to alter that. I haven't really opened up these boosters for a while, so let's go. You never know, we might get something rare. It's still new, we're still getting new cards. So. That's all right. And obviously it's giving us experience as well. It was a shiny one in there. And it was new, but it, well, it didn't... Oh, there you go. 40 for that one. For that art card. Uh, that one was fairly poor. Not even one. Checking it's a currency for that one. Poor, very poor. Put the light on, get selling. And they give us a note, and we didn't have to give them change. That's the very rare um, 19 <laughs> generic units of currency note. <laughs> yeah. Honestly, uh, quite uncommon. Right, let's go with accessories. I do need another set of red deck boxes. But do I go with the green and the yellow licenses? I think because of how much the red are selling, it's probably worth me picking it up. Yeah. I'll get that. 191. Can't afford that. Oh, but I will be I will be uh, affording it now though. There we go. Brilliant. So Get that purchased. I know every time we do that, we are paying a delivery fee of five, but I'm not going to lose too much sleep about over that one. Let's put that there. I'm just going to dump that down. A couple of these have been uh, sold as well. Um, let's put that one in there. So that's uh, 45. I think I'm going to go for that one. And we've already got one of those because I recognize it. It's fine. It's fine. Hello customer. Whoa, that's a big purchase. Is it one's birthday perhaps? Wow, 183.50. Possibly the biggest purchase we've seen in the game. That's good. 
Excellent. What will we do with that? What will we do with that? Well, it's going to have to be green license. And then we'll pick up the next one. I say, if minimum, if we get all of the deck boxes, it'd be really handy. Mm. The card sleeves is the curious one that we're just not selling it. To 40, I'm going to set that to. Oh, stinky. Customer. There we go. And let's see. It's uh, 7 or 2 p.m. Let's see if we can get another sale or two in for the rest of the evening. What do we need to restock up on? We need these boosters and some of those big packs. The licenses, the basic card box, they are just, you just get more. And I think the unit price. So the unit price is the same, so it's just quantity for the order, that's all it really is. These epic card packs is 800, then you've got a legendary, then you've got different level, uh, different like, what are they, like different flavours of fire, earth, oh yeah, water and wind, alright yeah, fair enough. And this is the basic Destiny pack. They're a different type. We, we won't even look at any of this stuff until like later on in the game. Uh, figurines. I mean, we could pick up the, f the figurines and accessories, things like that. What other things can we have get accessories-wise? Just the deck boxes. You've got playmats as well. Playmats would be good, to be fair. And you've also got like, like these books and stuff. But like that's It's saying on level like 50 and stuff. It's like, yeah. If I even get close to that it'll be a surprise <laughs> it really will be mm, don't need to sell any of those probably need to oh do we have any uh these different which one's this is that white close the box yeah that's why you close them because then you get the you get the little label on it I think that's black yes Get rid of that one. And can't sell any of those. Right. Earning a little bit of money from people coming in and playing. Nothing major. Oh, looks like they're picking up some deck boxes again. Two of in red. And two change. Another customer. Blue and card sleeves. Uh, five. Sixty? Oh, yes, because we knocked those. Uh, Sleeves down to 40. And let's just go ahead, put some of these in. Average price is five, I'll set it to six. And I'll sell that to, set that to six as well. Okay, oh, right, it looks like lowering the price is uh, massively helped out there. Uh, 3270. Yeah, the price is just getting weird now because of the because of that and we will go to the next day so let's see we've made money apparently that one day 10 all right let's just straight straight open the shop no messing around put those on the shelves all this is filled up when do we get the basic boxes for them mm, shop level nine well we'll get it today basically get some green deck boxes and get it on the shelf good now what are these gonna be worth 17 gonna go for 19 for those obviously the price does fluctuate so we do have to periodically check it mm, that seems to be a bit overpriced I'm gonna knock it down a bit that seems fair. The question with a lot of this is, is it better to sell relatively cheap and do high turnover? Or risk running with a slightly higher price? I was gonna I was looking over there thinking, should we've uh twenty-one fifty 
I thought. Yeah, I was looking over there thinking, has that, uh, has that been emptied, that, on the top? And yes, it had. Okay. So we will hit the next level shortly, and then we can pick up the rare card box license. I will have to get that rather than the other one. But I think eyes on the prize stick with going for the yellow box licenses. I think that's the that's the overall plan. Yeah, I think so. Then we need another card shelf because at level 12 we get the epic card packs. But also I'm tempted to do shop expansion to see what it's like. Mm. It's 300. The thing with that is, which way will it go? Probably just go back over. We'll see. 26.50 for that purchase. And obviously it'll be another empty slot here. Order by price. Put that one on there. 5.50. Normally round it up, don't we? So it's fine. Uh, morning. Lots of card boxes for you. Excellent. And change is 49. Interesting. And there is enough for the next license. Accessories wise. Yellow. Add to cart. It appears like we're not making a huge amount because of the... Because of the uh, licenses that we've got, we're giving ourselves a lot of options. But we do need to obviously keep restocking. But it's a it's a you know it's a one time license thing. You buy it once and job done. That was good money for them playing in here. And good selling there as well. All right. Uh, 157. Total value is 186. Okay, fair enough. Fair enough. When it comes to the events, I've not really bothered with running any other events. You've got Earth Cups and Water Cups and things like that. I don't know how... I don't know if there's anything we're really missing out on that. This can be a good, good amount of money. Uh, 1250. Yeah. 87. That means in, that means we can complete the quest of getting one of every type of deck basic uh, colour box in the game. I think. Average price is 15. 21. We'll put it to 17. Uh, oh, lots of lots of sales here. And 102 for that one. Excellent. Uh, 13 change. So that's all good. We need to put in... Right, we need to do some restocking, don't we? I need to get a... What do I need? I need a box of those. Box of those. At least one of those. And I then need the license for the next one as well. What else do I need? Probably red dice. I think that's about it. Oh, sorry, customers. And 1850 for that. And that's 11 for that. Oh, good grief. We are really in need of uh, sorting this out. Let's go with 550 for that one. I don't know if the customer will run up and pick up a card if it's got no price set. I'm not too sure. I'm hoping they don't. And four. Put that one in there. It's a pretty good looking card, actually. All the arts are pretty nice to look at. I think that might give us... Is that the right amount? Oh, no, 400 and odd. What, what is the main... Oh, it's the dice, isn't it? Well, I can wait. What I'm going to do in the meantime is... Rip some cards open. Already have buyer's remorse. <laughs> Nothing in there was worth it. 
nothing in there either. There's a shiny in there. And a couple of new cards. So, okay, we made a little bit on that one. And, oh, 23 for a Silver Edition Clawdos. Good. Nothing in this next one. It's jumping out, really. And that one, no, not at all. And new card, Silver Edition. But it's not, like, a great note price-wise. Yeah, that was fairly poor, that one. Anyway, get back to selling. Uh, we need to make money somehow. <laughs> Certainly not doing it by opening these uh, these singular cards. Let's uh, rearrange this by price. And we'll put in that one. So this is worth 23. Sell for 25. That should do quite nicely. I keep on looking, do I open even more? <laughs> yeah, go on, why not? Why not? Here we go. It gives us experience, doesn't it? And you never know what you're going to draw. There's some, look, look, even there, we've got some new ones, which I don't know if you get more experience for. Nothing great there. Do another draw. Nope. Oh, there's a Esme Rock. It's an EX rare card. And a, an, another ex exclusive Mumug. So we've had a very good look of run with that draw. Oh, and a 2 Frost. Nearly 18. So that, that, that's been okay, that one. Happy to say. So let's see what the rest of it. Ah, two cans of anti-stink spray. Let's sell that one there. 23. And what would I like for stock? Put one blue on there. And no, not there either. Lights on. Let's save out stock. We need 446 for the next, for our next buy. Yeah. Which is going to restock most of this. And then I think, actually, I'm not, don't even think. <laughs> That's true enough. Uh, <laughs> I think we're going to go for the next deck box, which is 500 for that license. But I do want to restock the shelves first. Do I want to do some more drawing of here? Why not? Because we still got some rares off last time. There's a silver edition in that one. And we're still getting the gold. There's a gold edition. So the value's, the value's actually coming okay there. And there's a 10 for a sapling. Or sapling, I think it was. No, it's sapling. And, oh, 88 for an anamite. And it was a gold edition. And just to think, all of this was sitting on our shelves all along. That draw was poor. Another new one there. Let's go ahead and sell. Apparently, card slaves is <laughs> what we're selling here, which is good. And no. Which one? Blue, no. Let's put, refill the card sleeves. And I think we can... No, we can't. Uh, we're on 437. Oh, this is going to get us over the... Over the finishing line. And that means we can... Purchase! So, basic boxes here. And red dice previously one of our most successful items in the shop. Let's just absolutely stack this as best we can. Are we out? No. Let's uh, serve this customer. Uh, 57 for that one. And then all of these as well. 
So they're already picking up as we're putting them on the shelf. Good. Let's get some more cards here. Just going to rearrange my price, and then it's going to be that one. And we'll sell that for 95 Nice shiny one there. Hang on a second. Got some cleansing to do. <laughs> Cleaned a hundred smelly customers. Really? There's that many customers? Apparently so. Uh, change of 20, 35, 6. Pretty much down the list. Good. And... Let's do that. I do need some more spray then. Accessories. I'll get some of that. I know I'm saying I'm saving up for the next license, but I do like to have that in stock. Where possible. It looks like someone's purchased some dice here. Hope you're happy with your purchase. Double blue. Ah, yes, that famous 33. Do you know giving the currency naught that the British give us? Um... <laughs> I don't know what the white dice aren't selling. Let's go for 15.50. Just reduce that down a bit. Oh, do you have any uh, more? Do you have any more dice? Black dice? No. What time are we on? Oh, it's almost end of day. All right. Well, that's been a bit of uh, TCG. I was the <laughs> trading card game. Yes, uh, Card Jump Simulator. Let's finish off with the selling here and see how we get on. I think that, uh, hopefully some purchases have been made here, yeah. Uh, overall, happy. We've got in a new shelf and a lot more product, which is good. That's what we want to see. We'll leave it there for now. Next episode, we will look at... I might even restock this, you know. Oh, there's still more people coming in the shop. Well, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to let them go through it. Why not? If we're making money, who am I to uh, stop customers' purchases? Let's go ahead. Very much worth staying open for 25. <laughs> Alright, now we'll end it there. So, next episode we will look at doing a bit of a restock and probably going for that new card box. As always, hope you have enjoyed uh, this fairly chill look at the game and... Thanks so much for watching. Take care and generic partings.